Now, by dividing the land into three parts and giving one part to the Sunni Waqf board, the Ayodhya verdict has cleared the way for both a Ram temple and a mosque to exist, exist side by side. A perfect example of a temple and a masjid coexisting in perfect harmony is to be found in Pune. In Pune's Ghorpadi Gao, this unique congregation is 18 years old. The windows of the masjid opens into the yard of the Kashi Vishweshwar Mandir. A wall separates them only somewhat. The masjid has been here for 200 years. In 1992, the year that saw massive communal riots following the demolition of Babri Masjid, Hindus and Muslims came together to build the temple whose foundation had been laid adjacent to the mosque. हमारे जो शंकर जी का मंदिर बना है उसी के अंदर मुस्लिम भी भाई नहीं कम से कम 20 एक लोगों ने भाई मिलकर मंदिर बना है उन्होंने बहुत मेहनत किया है व्हेन इट्स टाइम फॉर अजान द आरती स्टॉप्स एंड वाइस वर्सा ईद दिवाली शिवरात्रि मुहर्रम अ कॉमन सेलिब्रेशंस भगवान सबका एक है ईश्वर अल्लाह तेरो नाम सबको सन्मति दे भगवान सबको सन्मति दे भगवान सारा जग तेरा संता द एरिया डिराइव्स इट्स काम फ्रॉम दिस रिलीजियस हार्मनी Peace prevails even in times of communal discord. Both dharma ke liye bahut achhi misal hai, aur yahan pe log bhi bahut achhe ek saath rehte hai. The broad message that the court verdict on Ayodhya is: on God there should not be any dispute, and if a mandir and a masjid can coexist peacefully in a city like Pune, the question is: why not in other parts of the country? In Pune, with cameraman Afsawali. इम्तियाज जलील फॉर एन डी टी वी